Microsoft just hit pause on the entire industry with its announcement of autonomous AI agents. If you haven't heard, they're rolling these out across Copilot Studio and Dynamics 365, and it's going to change the way we work. I've been diving deep into this, and I can't wait to share how these agents are going to impact our everyday workflows. And we are going to break it down right now. With the announcement around autonomous agents that you can create. In fact, today uh, you will see us both make announcements around tools uh, that are going to help create these autonomous agents. Satya Nadella, Microsoft CEO, was all over Twitter talking about this, and I was immediately intrigued. Microsoft's vision for these autonomous agents is wild, and they're calling them a constellation of agents. Think of it like having your army of AI assistants that can handle everything from basic prompts to fully managing complex tasks without you even lifting a finger. Uh, I mean, imagine that your own workforce of AI working around the clock to keep things moving. Uh, but more importantly, the agents themselves that we are building for products like Dynamics 365, uh, which ultimately can dock to uh, something like Copilot when it needs a UI for human connection, uh, but also can stand alone. Uh, uh, what really blew my mind is how next level these autonomous agents are. These aren't just little bots doing one-off tasks. No, these agents can plan and execute and adjust on their own, fully autonomous. They can take a series of tasks and run with them over days, weeks, or even months. Think of all the time that could save us. Now, let's talk about Copilot. If you've been using it, you know how handy it is. But with this new update, Uncopilot isn't just a tool. It's becoming an orchestration layer for all your business applications. Basically, or it's the glue that holds everything together. And now, with Copilot Studio, you can create, customize, and manage these AI agents easily. Microsoft made it so intuitive that literally anyone can build these agents using natural language. This is all going public next month. Microsoft is moving these agents from private to public preview. So more of us can start using agents to streamline our processes. They respond to triggers, reacting to changing business conditions, whether it's a specific event in your business or something scheduled to happen. The kicker is, this isn't just theory. Uh, they have been testing these new AI agents in real companies that are already putting these agents to work. Microsoft is launching 10 new pre-made agent templates in Dynamics 365. They're built to handle real-world tasks. Here are some examples previewed in the demos. The sales qualification agent is an absolute game changer. With an incoming email from a prospective client, much like you see on the screen right here. Now, previously, they had had people on the back end, essentially receiving these emails, parsing through them, and figuring out what to do next. Who should it be routed to? What expertise did they have in the firm? But this is where the autonomous agent comes in. Now, an email comes in, and the agent springs into action. What you see here is that it will begin to parse out the email, moving through the ambiguity of human language to, for instance, find out what the engagement's about, to check the engagement history, to also map it to their industry standard terms. And then finally, to try and find the right person to take the next step within the firm. With all of this information in hand, the agent then goes about writing an email that takes all of this information and summarizes it for the receiving partner. And what you see on the screen is exactly that. In comes a whole bunch of human written email. The agent processes it summarizes it and sends it to the right partner in the firm to take that very next step. Now, it's worth pausing for just a moment here to reflect on what you're seeing. It happens so fast, you, you might miss it. But essentially, this agent has been given a loose set of instructions, kind of like you would to a human, and it deals with all of the messiness of human communication, figuring out what the right next touch point is for the customer. Honestly, this is one of the most exciting developments I've seen in AI. We've talked about AI automating tasks for years, but with these autonomous agents, we're finally seeing it in action. What do you think? Are you ready to let AI take over some of the heavy lifting? Let me know in the comments. And as always, don't forget to like and subscribe for more updates on AI.